Welcome to Grand Finals between SK Dale and Skyrazen. Which one is which? Uh, we'll find out. I mean, <laughs> in Winner's Finals, uh, Skyrazen was Green Chomp, and I, I think he is again. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. he is. The apply, I believe, is always the green, is always the different color. Yeah. Ooh, he gets counter attack there. Nice. Gosh, it's so hard to talk about that jump stuff in my opinion. Like to me. Because he, like, it's just like such weird stuff. It's like the one character you have to go play. I go into that AY. Into the running. Into the running one. Park Y. I believe it is what it is. Sounds about right. Yep. Ooh, nice. He gets frog a frog. Tries oh, to pizza. yeah. Pizza Cutter not connecting. But that stone Second egg one. Pizza. Second pizza didn't. Alright, nice, 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 nice grab. Tries to run in, is able to work it out uh, with the Toga, only with the Toga this ball. Ooh, two digs, insane combo. Almost puts himself in the corner if he's able to get out in time. Jumps the sand thing. Isn't able to capitalize off of it as much as he probably wanted to. Green Chomp puts himself in a good position just by using his very fast movement. Goes for a release X. Punishes with his own release sex. Go for a grab. Grab back. Ooh, pretty close here right now. Yep. Two HP left. On green chomp. Does hit the oh! storage. I think that's, that's it. Yeah. Oh, man. I think, so he had three stone edges and he used three stone edges three times starting to hit each one of them hit. Oh, jeez. <laughs> each one of them hit. I don't think, I don't think SK Dale used stone edge once last, or during the last set. <laughs> Hits that dig, goes through everything with that dig. Ooh, tries to run underneath Blue Chomp. Barely doesn't. Ooh, a little bit of cross up, up. yeah. There was a little bit of a cross up that resulted in nothing. I mean, uh, nothing came A hit. A little bit of damage. Hit a counter, hit a counter, and then that counter did Oh. That's an out. Really good damage there from Sky Racing. At least that's on the wall. My least favorite interaction ever. This is the scariest thing, is to be up against the wall and getting hit by release sets. Oh yeah. And that dual phase starting in the corner was a tricky situation on its own. Yeah. Set up. Green Chomp goes into burst. Just a reminder, Green Chomp is scary. Green Chomp is SK down. Ah! Uh, that is not going We'll to get hit. blocked, He's, yeah. Okay, yeah, he, he did a ghost hop, so he had time. Uh, uh punish? Yes. yes. Okay. Minus 20. If I'm correct. Yeah, yeah. Dale is getting that on. I'll always remember the yeah. line, it's minus 20 even on a phase change. Yeah. <laughs> I'll always remember that line he commentated. Because I was playing against Ajinabi. Oh, jeez. He said that, I'm like, that's sticking in my head forever now. Okay. Ooh, SKDL grabbing the nugget. Yep. Nice counter there by Scary. Alright, using approach options into the sample. Put himself in a good position, put him in the corner. Another no, yeah. one. Put himself more in put himself more into a good position. Nice good jump. Yeah, jump good day. Now Escadale uh, is in the corner here. Skyrazen has the advantage. So, a little bit of a camera. I just take the time to appreciate that Skyrazen literally ruined Garchomp just because he's played against Escadale so much. <laughs> He's played against Escadale so much in Bracket and on Friendlies. He just decided, I'm going to learn Garchomp because I've seen so much of it. He's Might as well. Almost toe to toe. Yeah. He's basically toe to toe in the matchup. In the ditto. Probably one of the best ways to understand the matchup is to play with characters. So. Makes sense. Yeah. In good ways and in bad ways. That kind of process. Yeah. And this is definitely a good way to learn about it. Yeah, right. Seal off a lot of HP there with that yeah. wall bounce. In with the cover first. first, no PB. Just kind of running around trying to take down the time. We're only at like seven seconds left. Yo, oh, connects easy. the homing. Yep, connects that homing. All right, SK Dale taking the first game. Yeah, that HP coming back for Dale really didn't help scare him. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
expose this. I'm doing it. Alright. No changes whatsoever. A lot of back and forth here. Yep, yep, yep. And I'm trying to see if he can hit stuff. Hit him with the pocket sand out of dig. Tries to go with the kick at 6 wide. Gets that counter into the purple. Into the 6 wide. Very nice combo. Oh, nice. Release no axe. sand tombs today, sir. No. No more. Hits the earthquake. Ow. It's weird that that's. It's, like. In actual Pokemon, you would take double damage, but like that, you technically lose that interaction. I mean, play. in technical Pokemon, these two would be doing super effective damage to each other. Yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> yo, that 102 speed though. It's me. It's got the tailwind going. All right, well, Sky isn't taking that uh, first round. Yep. Dale gets the home again. Tries to bait out the counter, but whiffs anyway. Nice Stone Edge can canceling the Stone Edge there. I asked for Dale. I don't know if you saw that. I had to calculate something he, he real fast. He was doing something else, yeah. Sand Tomb, setting it up. Yep. You're taking one or the other. And in all honesty, I'd rather take the grab. It's likely that... If you're getting yourself into the corner, they likely already have a few phase shift points in there already. <laughs> so, in my opinion, it's just better to take the same team at that point. Jeez. I cannot. I would not be able to handle that grinder at all. It's, uh, it's yeah. Trap. I mean, Weavile on any of the characters, you just start to zoom in. The Weavile, you, I feel like you kind of condition yourself into the speed regardless. Oh, I said Weavile. I'm in Tokyo, yeah, sorry. Because I remember uh, Togekiss on, like, Mega Gengar. Oh, oh, yeah, man. When that homing comes <laughs> in, you just freak uh, out. It's <laughs> just like, ah! That's spooky. I just remember something. We didn't use our spooky names. Oh, we didn't. I just remembered that, yeah. <laughs> oh. Spooky anyway. I got this. Hold on. It's just spooky finals. Yes! New main tournament. <laughs> you take, yeah, you take Gengar. I don't care about Gengar right now. <laughs> you guys are gonna love it. Look at the frog here. Isn't able to work. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> A little too much. Spooky Dale. And spooky Raisin. Ah, it's a little too much. Okay. That's enough. Grand final. All right. It, yeah, it's grand final. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, end of the release six. Dale in burst, by the way. I just realized that. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Both grabbed at the same time, uh, but scary is just a little faster. Goes for Ooh, all right. Scary is in hits in game two. I ended up 1-1. One, one. It's going to be a half hour grand final. <laughs> We'll see. Blaze You just quit. <laughs> you just quit. That's another option. No, that's no fun. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Let the record stand that I am a terrible influence. Yeah, you are. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Don't do it. Do it. No! Alright, I'm doing it. I'm gonna jump through that spooky portal. No, nah, man, that sounds like a bad time. I'm gonna jump go through there. No, nah, don't. You should come too. Alright, alright, alright. Go with the soccer ball in the mid air. By the way, Dale is, yes, going to play. Yes. We did not mention that. So. What are you talking about? How are you going to get some? Um, I mean, this is a tough matchup in general because of the anti-airs that uh, Garchomp has. Um, but I think Eskadale has a bit more of an advantage than I would because he understands Garchomp a little uh, better and knows what's... Um, like, he has more on-surface knowledge of uh, what is punishable for uh, Garchomp. Um, I'm obviously super rusty right now, so I don't 
like know that off the top of my head. We all kind of are, so it's just, like, we all understand. I literally, I have not to go off on my own thing, but I st sorry, tag haven't played since the last monthly, and I was at, I was at, and that was like the last two or three monthly ago. Oh yeah. So, Ooh, All right, release Nixon X getting him. Nixon. Yeah, yeah. That, release X is one of the uh, banes of Blaze getting this matchup, too, since it's an anti-air. Um, yeah. Of course, in that situation, he was in the air, so it was kind of a... Um, and it's really hard to force him release X. Because mm -hmm. a big Garchomp player knows exactly when to bring it out, and they're not going to waste it. Right. They're not going to waste it on a chance. They shouldn't, at least. You gotta find those. You gotta be able to find those times when they're not gonna get it out. Right? Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah, it's like right, like finding the times right after it, and not after a power. Oh! Because likely when they're doing that combo, they're likely already gonna be getting out. They're already gonna be charged. It's already in the charge. So really, I think about it. Yep. So we can do that first. Oh, finish. yep, yep. Every character can do that. I don't, actually, I think Suicune and Seth out can do that because their first takes, takes a little longer. Oh, it's it's a counter, because uh, yes. Chandelier would be the same. Um, there the is Chandelier starts up quicker. Yeah, I think it's Aegislash Slash is the only one who has iframes that last longer than Blaziken's or something. Uh, maybe I can't remember. It's been a while. Um, Would that have been on the spreadsheet that we used to have? I don't. I don't know. If we I don't think put that so. On the yeah. But Sky Raisin is going to take um, game three here. We're going to move into game four. Uh, no changes from SK Dale. We're going to see how this goes. Yeah. I mean, this it's it's a uphill battle, but it is doable. Yeah. Um, so Especially we'll, uh, for SK Dale. Yeah. It's counterattack off. Absolutely. All the pressure in the world is on his side. Mm-hmm. His, his pressure he, game with Dark Shock is so impressive. Yeah. Oh no, the cross up. I think uh, Blaziken in the advantage. Yeah. Oh, no. Even if you, like, you know a character, you still, like, when you're playing a character you haven't played in a while, you still have to rely on fundamentals, even though you know the character. <laughs> and uh, relying on fundamentals, oh. relying on fundamentals is so hard. Mm. It's so hard to do for some people. Myself included. I don't know how it is to be with SK Dale or Skyrim, but. No. Nice corner from right there. Nice guy is gonna take round one there. That was that was just one dual phase. Mm -hmm. It never it never changed. Go for the Emolga. Oh, the Emolga, pretty good, pretty good. We'll be able to get it back later in the match. Oh, there we go. Very nice. As I was gonna say, Emolga just as a as like a little lesson thing. Emolga is built to be used for it. Oh yeah, yeah. It's very fast and it's very good. You want to use, you want to use it as early as you can so that you can get it later in the match. Unless you're like, Shadow Mixon. <laughs> right, right. Which, oh! Mix him with that stone. Yeah, but, almost got it out of there. Yeah, at least the combo isn't going to be as powerful as Skyrim with one of It wouldn't be considered a counter. It wouldn't be considered a crit. First one goes into burst. Coming up with the Frogadier. Yeah. Oh, oh, mm. oh, that, yep, that yeah. will connect. I wasn't sure if he did that fast enough. I wasn't sure if uh, I thought he got launch him away too far. Yeah, he I, got boot by the Emolga. Well, I, I thought Blaze King got boot. He got, he got spun and he did it as soon as he could. Mm. And it still worked out. I thought because I thought the skin will last too long. Uh, yeah, he same did. here. And then I thought the Dark Trap was going to get knocked away too close, too quickly by Emolga. In which case, I believe that last hit really helped that. <laughs> Definitely. Yeah. It's just a lot of good timing on that one. Oh. Into the laser. Yep, yep, yep. And that yep. is 3 1 Skyrim. <laughs> All right. Well, Skyrim is going to take the bracket. 3 1 on that one. The top three is our usual. Uh, Not yeah. usual, but 2019 usual. Right, right. 2020. All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. We will see you next time. Yeah.